and this time the tennis court with a group of club athletes who are looking to make their national championship mark. Check it out. We saw Iowa football go to the Rose Bowl in Pasadena, California. We saw the rise and the fall of Iowa men's basketball when they lost to Villanova in the second round in Brooklyn, New York. But little do people know that the Iowa club tennis team punched their ticket to their USTA and Nationals this upcoming weekend, something that they've been working towards all season long. 63 other co-ed club and intramural tennis teams will join Iowa at the championships. And for Iowa, this will be their second year in a row with the bid. We're always happy to make it to nationals. I mean, that's always kind of our goal from the beginning of the season is uh, to get to that big tournament at the end of the year. We went in last year. We had a really good team, but we didn't end up doing as good as we wanted to. Despite last season, the bid did come with a disappointing loss in sectionals, though. The second day, we went all the way to the finals, and it was kind of a heartbreaking loss. And it had kind of a heartbreaking loss in the championship. We ended up losing by one game. Even with the loss, the team is ready for a rebound. We feel ready for nationals, so we're ready to get back on the winning track and you know, finish strong. The team has the same mindset, but for some, it'll be their very first time competing at nationals. I mean, just to go as like a Big Ten college and go and play um, is really exciting, especially, fresh, like I said, freshman year is really fun. As for the seniors, it will unfortunately be their last. This is one of the first clubs in or organizations. Everyone was very welcoming, very friendly, and I've been with them for two years. We're all really close. So it's going to be sad, but I've enjoyed it. It's, uh, it's weird, honestly. I mean, it's, so it's an end of another, the end of another chapter in my tennis career. Um, you know, lots of memories with this team over the last four years. I've met a ton of awesome people. Uh, this group of people really means a lot to me. We'll have all the coverage and the updates from Cary, North Carolina on the show next week. Reporting inside the HTRC, Taylor Brooks, Daily Iowan TV Sports.